here. And you, I think, I don't remember what the shot was before that. You drew right back over to this rail. Perfect, right? And it bounced out just a crack. Like maybe about that much. Right? And then he just immediately just got straight up. And you're, I'm, I'm looking at, here's your, here's your thing coming straight down. I'm like, what the fuck is going on now? <laughs> Serious, this is how good you were, boy. So you just drilled it, right? With draw and just popped out straight for your ball, like over here. I'm like, what the fuck? Who does that? The bridge you put out there was so perfect. Just a steep, unbelievable fucking angle. And as soon as I saw the shot, I'm like, there's no way he's going to miss this. It's perfect. That's kind of when Danny started with the magic cube. It was almost right at that time. Man. Hey, that was uh, <laughs> the magic cube. I was there, cube. man. He, he was watching the same shit I was. <laughs> he's never seen that shot. Okay, look. We, yo, Danny. I'm playing Danny Colas, and I'm beating him so bad. Do you remember that shot? When I, when I just... When I just, hold on, that I just got my cue, uh, this poison cue, and I'm beating him so bad, I'm making such unbelievable shots, he starts to saying that my cue's magic, <laughs> and he won't play, right? Yeah. And he won't, magic. magic, he's saying, you got a magic cue, <laughs> you, you're you not allowed to use that cue, he says, I'm going to quit, unless you, you can't use that cue, if you use that cue anymore, I'm quitting. And then he wanted to trade cues. Uh, yeah, yeah. Then, and then he, and then he said, Let me, I, I need to use that cue. He said, I'm going to... He did, right? Oh, my God, dude. He was dead serious. Dead serious. You don't remember that shot? How did it go again? Look. It. For you, it's probably such such a little deal. It's just unbelievable. You had some, you're, you're running out in a one pocket. I want to say you ran out. Yeah, maybe it might have been a seven. I don't remember. You know, like, bing, 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 bing. And then the last, like, two balls were kind of over this way. Right? So you could have banked or whatever, but you decided to draw over here, banged off this rail, and it came off about this much, right? For a ball that was right about here, almost like that straight. And that, that's you my thought. I, I want to say it was even slightly off angle this way. But you were so confident that you could put the exact right amount of English on. You could slightly throw it here, just pop off this rail and spin off this way. But I'm sorry, but remember, we're only this far off the rail. So we, our, our stick is fucking dead vertical almost. And right, I'm thinking, right. this is a fucking mouse station. Right. Basically. We're just going to hit it so square in the center, it's not going to say it all. It's just going to hit a perfect draw shot. That's how good this kid jacks up. That's fucking unbelievable. Honestly. I haven't seen Dennis do that shit. Do you remember that shot? That was when I beat Danny those eight games in a row, right? Yes. Yeah, I beat him eight games in a row in like 45 minutes. Eight or nine games in a row. It was fast, man. And it he was, was fast. he was and he was even telling me today he's never he's he's like, "Man, I I that was did, did something to me." He said that did something to me. You know what I mean? And uh he's like, "I never been beat like that ever in my entire life, ever. Never." And he was saying, you know what Danny was telling he me? He never will again either. That's never going to happen again. I don't think it could. You know what else Danny was telling me today? You know what's so funny? Listen to this, Jimmy. Tell me. He sits down next to me, right? And he says, uh, he says, you know, Jay, I'm real glad that I got to play in you. Even though I lost a lot of money, I said, lost a lot of money, Danny. I said, every time somebody beat you, they beat you at 1000 1700 I said, you lose 100 200 I don't even, you owe me money. You know what I mean? So what do you, t you know, so he's like, uh, he's like, no, but I, I want to thank you. He's like, man, he's like, uh, I used to see, you know, good players play and I knew I was a good player back then. And now I see you play and I see that there's another level of play and it makes me inspired when I play my billiards because you do things that I've never seen anybody do on a consistent basis. He's like, and I do those things in billiards, he was telling me. Yeah, he's absolutely. Like, he's like, I do those things in billiards. And I know that I'm something, you know, pretty good in billiards, too, because I'm doing things that I don't see other people doing. You know what I mean? I'm playing with these pros, and I'm not seeing them do what I do. I believe you know? No, he, he hits shots that I've never seen on, like, the billiard videos and shit. He does, too. I'm telling you, that when he's trying the 10, that was, that was the same kind of level of ball strike I was seeing when you do your shit, you know what I mean? That's how cool it was to see that on a billiard table. I think he's, I think a lot, like the old timers already, he's a too much spin, but those guys don't hit more flat.
assholes. Right. You know, that's what I'm seeing on the television. I think that's why Efren's not like, um, can't quite go. I don't, I haven't seen enough to really say that though. I mean, obviously he's a great player. 